Hello everyone and welcome to my blog at Lucas Nu. Today I will show you how to create the responsive logotype. When I say responsive, I mean when you will stretch your screen, the logotype will adapt to the screen size. So it will look beautifully on your tablets and the mobiles. Alright. Uh, so uh, this is my blog. Currently I'm using theme from uh, UTHEM and it calls organic. They have instructions uh, how to set the, the logotype uh, for your website, uh, but they recommend to use PND. I don't like it at all because it looks uh, very uh, oh, ugly, <laughs> you can say. Uh, instead, I would recommend to use SVD. SVD is a scalable vector graphics. It's a vector image format. Uh, it's two-dimensional graphics uh, that supports interactivity and animation. It's exactly what we need. Um, all right. So we go to Illustrator and we open a new file or create a new file and we uh, design our logotype and then we save it as SVD. Now I'll show you step by step how to do it. Right, file, new. Uh, here you can uh, set the uh, uh, image size. 157 and 75 pixels will be good for mine. Write something simple. My logo. All right. Now it's important step. It's free. I cannot do anything. <laughs> now, finally, create outlines. This is a very important step because it will help you to avoid the uh, mistakes. Uh, all right. And now we save it as SVD. This is a magic button. It calls SVD code. Click on this one. Uh, you see the set of numbers. And this is actually your logotype. So you want to delete the first few lines until here. Uh, your code starts with SVD version blah 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 blah. So copy, uh, select all, then copy. All right. Then go to your widget. As I said, I'm using uh, U theme, and it is very famous for this widget sets. All right, then we go to text and we drag and drop this text to your logo. All right, here we write something like logo, and in this um, tab we passed the code of SVD logotype. We save it. All right. It's very very interesting to see how. It... We got one more logo here. Voila! One look, two logos. Of course, if I will delete this one, uh, my logo will appear uh, on the center. But I don't want to do it, of course, because I spent. Some time. Alright, so I delete this version. Okay, uh, but uh, since the logotype is responsive, we want to create a smaller version for your mobiles and tablets. In your theme, you have this option. It calls logo small widget. So same 
principle, you take your text and you drop it here. But before that, you go to your Adobe Illustrator and create a smaller version of your logotype. Something like this. Save us. SVD. Save. Code. Delete the first few lines. Select all. Copy all. Go to edit. happened of course because it will work only for the mobile version you see voila I guess we're done uh, why I like uh, SVD is because you actually cannot save it as a picture so no one can copy your logo, plus it looks very beautiful. And uh, also, if you want to change the whole style, uh, CSS style for your WordPress website, uh, you can change the logo type colors as well, without uh, manipulating the logo type itself. So, we're done. Congratulations.